Can we? Can we do it? I don't know, chat. I don't think so. Hey, what's up, Steam? How are you? We may be back there, but I have a feeling we may drop down there. Let's see if we can do anything up here first. We're all the dudes. We're the guards and stuff. Oh, hi. Freeze, motherfucker. I mean, hope, stalker. Oh. This is the commissary. You can't go in without a personal invitation from Roosevelt. Well. Right. Move along. Really? Take it to the boss. Who's there? Okay, chill out. So, we can't, like, go in and talk to either of these guys? We have to... We just have to murder one of them? Hmm. Okay. No, you can talk to them. Okay. Yeah, I, I, somebody said we could sneak in, but if I sneak in, let's, let's see what happens when we open the door. Wait, what? Hey, what's up, girl? How are you doing? Uh-oh. Oh, my Lord. Oh, why you do this to me? Why you do this? You've been outside, huh? Mm -hmm. Dang. You, you just, should feel my toes. You just warming up? Yes. This woman just walked into my office and put two ice cold hands on my back. Yep. Oof. Man, that is that's rough. It's wife tax. Wife tax. Oh, you're using me as a personal heater. Yeah. You know we have an actual heater. It's, it's not the same. It blows. I don't like, you know I don't like having air blown on me. That's fair. That's fair. Okay, that's fine. Well, you, you enjoy. I'm going to keep looting the zone. Mm. You take your time. Oh god, it's cold. Um Oh my god. It's so cold. It's so cold. It's so cold. You're fine. I'm trying to focus, it's hard. I'm toughen up. I I'm working on it. Here, how about that? Oh, 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 there we go. Yeah. Oh, it's like it's like a cold massage. I'm pretty sure this is like a thing they do in Scandinavia. It's like hot yoga. Oh, oh, you're mad. You're mad. You're mad. Okay, hold on. Love you, girl. Found him. Oh, just kidding. Nobody here. Put down your gun. Put down your gun. Put down your gun. Nobody here. Nobody here. Put down your gun. Put down your gun. No, you, did you not hear him? Nobody's here. Put down your gun. Okay. Just the wind. <clears throat> so that's not good. Um, that's not what I wanted to do. I wanted to talk to him, but apparently if he sees us, he gets angry. So maybe we should go to the main. Let's try this. Let's go to uh, here. First, let's do that on the way down. Let's go sell and stuff, and let's talk to the people here, and maybe they'll give us, like, a tip or a quest or something to try to get in here without getting murdered. Does Co have less pneumonia now? I still have pneumonia, but I do have less. Yes, which is great. Yeah. That's because you looted before talking to him? I don't know if there's a system in this game that does that. So I don't think that's it. <clears throat> Excuse me. Is there fast travel in this game? Um, sort of. It's not really usable on this difficulty. Take it to the boss. Go talk to the king. Pig. Oh, it's a lawyer. Ew. All right. Who's that? It's me. Hi. Life's good. The boss. 
Right. Okay, chill out. No, I'm not gonna chill out. All right. So if we are gonna kill someone, I think it's gonna be the Shah. But I I don't even know if I want to do that yet. Hmm. Hmm. Chill out. I will. Yeah. Oh. Let's not run through that thing again. We got so much stuff to bank. Whoa. I was going to say, I think they're going to die in there. I told you. That's probably not worth it. Let's go. Why am I beeping? Because we're right next to an anomaly. Right next to it. And the game is saying, please do not go further, you big old dumb dumb. That's basically what it's saying to us right now. Not so many words. Blorp. Okay. I have no idea what's here. Let's poke around a little bit. Oh, cool. Hell yeah. We'll take all the buckshot this game will give us. Buckshot is basically free monster kills. We love our buckshot. Ooh, here we go. Hell yeah. Lovely. Okay, let's go. Great. Whoa. Save. Bug shot? No, buck shot. Stuff for the shoddy. Buck shot is really, really good against mutants. What does the scanner show you? This scanner really kind of sucks, so it doesn't show much at all. Um, but normally the scanners can show you like where anomalies are, where artifacts are. What mine does right now is there's a light in the center of it. You see that blue cylinder in the middle? If there's an artifact nearby, it flashes. And as we get closer and closer to the artifact, it flashes more and more. So that this is the the most bobo basic protector we can or uh, detector we can get. It's terrible. Apparently there's another one around garbage somewhere, but I haven't found it yet. And uh, yeah. Hmm. Okay. Hey, Stony Nut, how are you? Faith Ox, hello. Casual Kev, did I ever play Red Dead Redemption 2? I did. I did play Red Dead, Red, Dead, Red Dead Redemption 2. Um, I thought the game was technically super impressive, but honestly, I think it's an okay game. I'm, I'm definitely not one of the people that thinks Red Dead Redemption 2 is, like, an amazing game. I thought it was alright. I had to force myself to finish it. Like, it didn't really grab me. I found the story to be pretty lame, to be honest. Um, but, yeah. It was, it was just, it was an okay game. G Mania says the story was great though. Think so? Like I I didn't think the story was very good because I knew exactly what was gonna happen in the middle of the game. Like literally in the middle of the game, I said, Oh, this is what the, this this is how this game is gonna end, and it's exactly how it ended. And then it took a long time to get to that point. So, like, I don't know, dude. I just didn't it like I feel like uh 
I feel like Red Dead Redemption 2 is one of those games that you go on not for the story, but for the journey of the story. Like, I feel like most people that love Red Dead Redemption 2 were not really surprised by it. They just enjoyed the ride. And I'm somebody who likes being wowed and impressed by the story. But I don't feel like the story was very good. I feel like they told the story really well. And if you like being told a good story, I think you could love it. But for me, I, I need the story to be good. I need the story to have meat. And I feel like the story didn't really have much meat in it. Yeah. Also, to put it bluntly, I am not a fan of historical games. Like a historical game needs to be really, really, really good for me to get into it. Like really good, especially if it's like realistic history. Um, I'm all about sci-fi, post-apocalyptic fantasy. Like I like stuff that isn't in this world. That's that's where my jive is. So, you know, it just it, it just wasn't for me. Left, left, Red Dead Redemption 2 is not a game that, that is was for me. I'm not the target audience. Yeah. But I, I mean, I understand and know it's a technical marvel. And like some of the, the immersive elements in that game, most games don't even attempt. So, you know, it's a really, it, that in that regard, it's pretty amazing. How do you like Kingdom Come then? I liked Kingdom Come because there's so few, like the type of game Kingdom Come is, is different than Red Dead Redemption. It's far less structured. And I like the sandbox elements more. Also, to put it bluntly, KCD, I can I can connect much more to fantasy than like Red Dead Redemption 2 is kind of like straight history. Um, but KCD is like almost fantasy <laughs> in terms of its of its like of the way that it plays. Yeah. I know it sounds kind of weird. Be but... hard time for the slag heap. The kingpins won't be happy if there's nobody here to shoot the shit with. Forgotten PDA? It seems your buddy's in a bit of a pickle. If you're sorting out, swing by the Sultansk and we'll have a chat. What is the Sultansk? Here's to the common good. Cottonwood. Hey, I remember you. Well, Cottonwood. You're the guy who got the head bro to that Oh! Yeah. Hey, yeah, yeah, cool. So where were they? Well, there you are. Where's Panas? Answer me. No panache, no coupons. Oh. Did the vodka have methanol in it? Maybe that's why he didn't come back. What do you take us for, eh? Our friends deserve nothing but the best. No offense, Stalker, but you didn't come through for us. So how about we pour you a drink as a consolation? Wait, what? <laughs> sure. Sure. Why not? At a boy, pour him a little extra. Is this guy about to knock me out and take my inventory? Buddy. What should we drink to? I swear to God. Here's to good company. May we have a hell of a time together. We feel like hell when we're apart. We're gonna get so loaded, we'll feel like hell whether we're together or not. Here's to the most important guy in the zone. Who's that? The bartender, of course. That's pretty good. Am I not passing out? Careful. Don't break it. You good? Is that the end of the quest? Like, is there really no more? Look who's here. Yeah, that's it. Cheers. Wow. Funny enough, this quest was kind of interesting because Hi. um, the guy Come that we had to drink. bring... The guy that we had to bring the alcohol to for these friends, these drunk friends, he he wanted to stop drinking. So we basically gave him the anti-rad meds so he could go off by himself and not be with his drinking buddies. And now his drinking buddies are pissed. But we had the option to give him vodka. So I wonder if we could have given alcohol to the guy that didn't want to be an alcoholic anymore. And if he would have ended up like right there being an alcoholic. <laughs> That would have been kind of silly. Yeah, Alley Baby. I was wondering, can we go get the stuff from the stash now? I really feel like... At this point, I feel like we should have marked the stashes. Talk to our boss. Oh, hello. Hey, bud. This place is a shit's creek without a boss. He's How smiling. How Esther just leave us like this? Oh, the stashes are empty now? Oh, bummer. See ya. Dang it. Hi, stalker. I'm never gonna get a new. Do you have new a, I always pick. have work for decent folk. Oh my god! Take your pick. We get a quest. Um. Pick up a 
package? I want this one. Okay, hold on a sec. Nah. If I can actually get one where we have the artifact. Is he going to ask us to get like a... What did he, what did he ask to get us last time? A horn? You haven't showed your scanner and drunk the coupons, have you? I'm just kidding. Don't... You're the one who's risking his ass after all. I like... Deal. Find a horn artifact. Okay, so I have no idea where a horn artifact is. So we're not going to take that quest right now. Yeah, 3750 is a ton of money, but... Can I get a bear detector? Dude, I have not even seen another detector. I, I cannot buy one. I cannot do anything. I do not... I have not even seen an, a new detector in this game. I don't know where to get one. So... An old stalker asks... Ever wonder why they built the lizard? Who was that? Why? Man, remember the last emission? The old man I thought the slag heap was gonna collapse on itself. I mean, holy shit. There was one in one of the drunk guy's stashes? Well, we couldn't take those. As they could. Diggers and crooks alike. This is it, I thought. Well, we're still alive and kicking, as you can see. I can. Thanks, yeah, Sashko Worm. Okay. I'm, I'm leaving, bro. I'm leaving. Nesta Who's that? The wrong time to piss yeah, off. get out already. Anyone in charge either? Chop, chop, loner. I kind of so wish. Long. I wish we could talk to random NPCs about more things. How's the gun? Any misfires? Good as new. A little grease and a good cleaning works wonders. <laughs> this is the guy that we got the drowned gun for. What do you want? See, that is that is cool. That almost every quest NPC we've talked to after the quest has had quest like related dialogue that's cool who's that okay chill out i'm i'm chill bro i'm chill you chill out hm. if you've got coupons oh no 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 i can take you anywhere yeah not for as much as you're charging you want to head out let's head out these guys need to be like 150 not 1500 that's crazy that is crazy I still can't believe that's in the game. All right. Take your pick, stalker. My prices are fair. Sergeant Squirrel says, no desire to play WoW with the OnlyFangs team. You know, I, I would have loved to have played WoW with the OnlyFangs guys. It would have been awesome. But I have this game I want to finish. I want to play more Factorio. We've got Indiana Jones around the corner. I want to play Metaphor. I'd like to finish Dragon Age. And none of those would happen if I started playing WoW. And that's, and that's not... Not even including the other three or four games I'd like to finish that I haven't yet. So, and PoE 2 is around the corner. <laughs> so, the short of it is, do I want to play WoW with my buddies? Yes. But I also would love to actually play some games for you guys. <laughs> and I'm also having a blast playing these other games too. So, it's just the timing didn't line up. The timing didn't line up. Yeah. I, I, it, I would have loved to, you but... Got some loot? I got too Let many other things I want to do. Too many other things I want to do. Mm-hmm. With that being said, if you are a WoW player, like, I strongly suggest checking out what those guys are doing. It's it's apparently a huge amount of fun. Like, tens of thousands of people have been watching it. I haven't had any time to check it out myself, but clearly it's going really well, so. Yeah, if you are a WoW player, be sure to check all of that fun stuff out, because it looks like they're having a blast. Uh, I'm going to sell you. I'm going to keep these for now. Okay. Now you don't have a better detector, do you? No, you do not. Okay. Okay. Gaz says, please don't play WoW. I'm not going to. No, no, don't worry. <laughs> I'm, I'm not planning to. Some loot next time. What advice can you give for fighting those invisible dudes that keep murdering with ease? Let me show you, Stagu. This is how you do it. You take out a shotgun, preferably one with a larger, um, a larger mag like this one. But what you basically do is you stand like this and you listen in your headphones and you will hear what direction they're coming from. You look where they're coming from. You try to shoot them once before they're there, but when they're about that far away, you start moving to the right. And if you move to the right and turn in a circle, they cannot hit you. So that's what you gotta do. So whenever they charge you, get a shot in, move to the side, they won't hit you. See if you can get a second shot in before they invis again and then just rinse and repeat. Yep. Boom. I've killed two at a time doing that, actually. You, you still take some hits if there's two at a time, but yeah. Billy Dan says, TikTok rips co. Do they? Oh. 
Well, that's unfortunate. Uh, don't yell at me. 84. Morning, I have a question. For the digital version, the stashes, when I get that quest, should I loot all of them now or just wait till the story takes me in that zone? Oh, Thanks. that's that's entirely up to you. So, so you do get some, some journalist stashes and stuff by uh, having the digital version. You can either get them, ignore them, or I mean, it's it's just, it's entirely up to you however you want to do it. Yeah. Um, they give, basically they give like skinned versions of other guns you'd find at that tier. So they are really good. If you want to find some good guns, I definitely recommend getting them early. Um, but yeah, it's it's just, it, you don't need to get them and it's kind of entirely up to you how you want to approach that. Um, oh. We're going to carry that. I didn't realize these give plus 20 weight for 300 seconds. Well, that's kind of awesome. Okay. Um, do we have any more buckshot? We do. Good. Um, I think carrying, carrying 60 on it should be fine for now. All right, so we currently have four different armors at full, which is great. So my, my plan at this point is I am not going to repair armor. I'm going to use armor until it's dead. And then when it's dead, I'm going to replace it. And I think that's my plan. Yep. And that way I think we can save some serious money. Okay. Okay. Cool. Let's do it. Uh, same with the head, by the way. As soon as this goes down, we have two. Oh, if you wouldn't mind, drink some water. Yes, sir, Ben. Um, but yeah, we'll, so let's see if we can do that. But I will say, I am very surprised right now. Because I have been given a quest to kill the two heads of two different factions. I have done every side quest that I can do. But I do not have a way to talk to either of these faction leaders before I kill them. That doesn't seem right. That doesn't seem right. What, what am I missing here? You just need to get one of their PDAs? Oh, these guys are not the full-on factions? Like, like, I'm, like, one of the things that I love doing in games is joining duty. That's what I do in my first playthrough. I join duty. I'd like to join duty in this playthrough. I don't even know if we can join duty. But I'm a little, I'm a little concerned because I don't want to go kill the main guy of duty. Um, maybe I did it out of order? Maybe. I don't know. I think I'm just going to go kill the Shaw. I think I'm just going to go kill the Shaw. Don't kill anyone. Try to negotiate peace. That's the thing, though. I, I like. I can't. I, I would love to do some kind of talk option, but I don't see one. Like I can't. If I go try to talk to the well, if I I tried to go talk to this guy, but the second I got near him, he aggroed, so I couldn't talk to him. And we have. Need, granted, we haven't tried to go through the door in this area yet. Maybe we can go through the door, but. Hmm. It's gonna be hard time for the slag here. I don't know. This feels weird. If you sneak in the way the drunk colonel told you, you can talk to Roosevelt. Let's do that. Let's do that. Let's do that. Maybe we can talk to him and convince and like join him to kill the Shaw. Let's try that. I will say the game did kind of hint that at us because the guy did specifically say... Um, he has it like, don't believe his lies or something. So let's go north and let's, let's try to do that. Good call chat. What's my FPS? Uh, about 70,000. 